What's up, core crew? Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl, Courtney Janine, and I'm back with another video. If this is your first time seeing me here on the YT, don't forget to subscribe. Join the core crew family down below. It's all over here. I do everything from wig reviews like you'll see today, wig installs, makeup tutorials, makeup reviews, try on hauls, vlogs, the whole nine. So if you like any of that type of content, definitely subscribe, join the channel because we are so 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 close to 4k so i'm super excited about that anyways <laughs> today's video is brought to you by iuz hair thank you so much to iuz hair for sponsoring this video you guys know that we love a sponsor on this channel okay let's go ahead and unbox so i actually already did unbox the unit today i will be trying my first tea part wig i haven't tried one before so i'm super excited what they sent me was the tilly low maintenance effortless lace tea part bob wig side part why choose a tea part wig it's an effortless install natural lace pre-parting pre-plugged and pre-bleached low maintenance never go wrong with i use the wig okay so i want to show you guys how it came so it came in this really nice bag you oh it came in this really nice bag you guys know that i love when it comes with things like this because it allows you to store your wigs like this you can either store it in like a satin bag which is probably better for the hair but this it comes with like a hanger so you can hang it up in your closet um which is really nice but it basically says i use the hair on it it has their email address and also their website on the bag as well as their logo inside came the wig it also came with two types of wig caps in two different colors so one's like a more like caramel color and one's like a more deeper brown and then it came with that hanger portion that i showed you guys about or how you can like put the wig on this and like store it which is really nice and then it also came with an adjustable no an elastic band i don't know i think this is an elastic band that you can like put inside the wig and like i said i've never tried one before so this is what the lace looks like in terms of like the pre-bleached it was bleached and they told me not to like mess with the hair like um cut it or um bleach the hair so i did not do that but i would probably bleach the knots one more time like they are they're still kind of there but once i tinted it it looks so much better um and also you could tell that it was pre-bleached because you guys know like sometimes when i bleach the knots on my hair um some of the like actual hair strands get a little lightened and that was the case so all that i did was go in with a little bit of mascara to kind of define the part and i also went in with my even lace tint spray um in warm medium brown cap construction it does come with the elastic band that you can either choose to install or you can easily take it out um it comes with an two combs in the front a comb in the back and an adjustable strap so basic cap construction i'm just gonna try it on you guys know that i love to try on my wigs first and then um go in and do my makeup and then come back to install so i'm kind of living it's super short i am going to change my shirt before i do like the final install and like the final look so you guys can actually see um the hair because the length is like right to my shoulders but i do have one of dark shirts so i am going to change that it's giving it's giving more on the mature side um so yeah but i really do like this unit it's really cute um i'm just going to go do my makeup honestly could see myself doing this as like a glueless install because it's already getting it's already giving on my head i wish that i could just like pluck it just a little bit more so that it wasn't so straight but it's kind of like i don't have much to like area to pluck since it's a deep part wig which kind of makes it easier for the girls who don't really like to pluck but for the girls who do and like to give scalp it's a little disheartening but anyways let me know your thoughts on this unit so far um the hair is really soft though which i love and I love the cut of it. But I will be back. I'm going to go do my makeup. And then I'll be back to install it. If you all are interested in seeing how I install this unit. I do have like a more in-depth tutorial. It's called How to Slay a Synthetic Wig. But honestly, I use those steps for like every single wig. Unless I decide to do a glueless install with this. So we'll see when I come back. But definitely check that out that video if you are looking for like step-by-step -step routine. In terms of like the hair, like the curls and stuff. The only thing I did was like I wet it 
with this like mister from pattern i love this like spray bottle honestly you don't have to get this one you can just get a spray bottle that has like this misting ability because i love that um and then i just went in with mousse and it kind of like gave the same effect it was like a curling custard or something like that the part is on the left so the hair is like on the right side all right you guys so if you are watching right now let me know in the comments your thoughts and i'll be back to install the unit once i finish my makeup i am back makeup is done i have my um wig right here i actually did a little bit more plucking um but i think i'm gonna do a glueless install so i just wanted to cut the lace on here just because after trying it on um it just like really was so Super like natural looking. Here's the final look as promised i did change my shirt so you guys can see the exact length so you guys know if you watched the install process i literally did a glueless install today i think the key with glueless installs is either getting a wig grip an elastic band and adjusting it as tight as possible so that's super snug let's get into my pros my cons and my final thoughts on this hair from iuz hair so in terms of cons i think that the only thing that i will note is the knots like the knots i think that it's just because I wasn't able to bleach the knots myself, like go in and bleach it a little bit more. But the knots are really dark, um, even though it came like kind of pre-bleached. So that's one thing that I will be um, super cognizant about. Maybe even if you get this wig, try bleaching it again. Or if not, definitely go in with a tint spray or more powder to make it look even more natural. Another con is just in case if you are a plucker like me, like if you like to pluck or like to get it as natural as possible with, you know, maybe putting in a little extra work, you might not like the tea part wig just because it is on the like, there's not much space for you to pluck. So that's just one thing to know. If you're not a plucker, you might absolutely love this wig because t-part wigs are super easy to install you don't have to do much to the like the frontal part because there's not much lace to pluck anyways with that being said like you can see the t-part as a pro or a con um it is a pro because you don't have to do much work it literally says on the site like easy to install so it really was especially since i went with a glueless install and it actually looks super duper good i really like the elastic band on this like very rarely do i have an elastic band where i feel like okay i can do this a glueless install so the fact that i put this on with no makeup and was like hmm i kind of see this as being a clueless install is a really big thing for me another pro that i really like is the hair texture i love a curly bob i love a curly unit sometimes 
folks will think that like curly hair requires a lot of work but honestly you guys I didn't do much to this hair all I did was wet it and apply a little bit of mousse I went in with the fluff stuff styling foam by Erica J but you can use probably a lot of body um, any mousse that you would like the hair is really soft I didn't experience any shedding or tangling with this unit yeah you guys I think those are my pros and my cons in terms of final thought I think that this is a beginner friendly wig I think that it is something that the girls who don't like to plug the girls who are looking for something easy to wear to work or something like that this is the unit it is a very like everyday type of length very easy to install like i literally just plop this on my head let me know your thoughts on this unit let me know if you have tried i use the hair down in the comments i look forward to speaking with you and chatting with you in the comments and i will see you guys in the next one bye guys